Well, welcome back to another video. Right here at Ciro's Italian. So delicious. Look at those mushrooms. Oh. They're hot. Cold water because it was so hot. <laughs> well, you got someone talking to you there. Um, yeah, these are really good. These mushrooms are so delicious. And they're stuffed with them pesto and mozzarella. So wonderful, so refreshing on a Sunday. Now, I don't, they do have a brunch menu. I don't order off the brunch menu. I'm not a big fan of um, regular breakfast, but I'm sure it's delicious. Everything here is delicious. <laughs> You can see. <laughs> I've got, I now have two selfie stands for my filming. So I can do my YouTube and uh, I can do another network at the same time. It's wonderful. I don't know how I came up with such a wonderful idea. Look at that. You can't go wrong with Italian food. You really can't. You can't go wrong with this restaurant either. Della and I've already got my, so you can see I got my dipping sauce. And they give you this fresh bread. And let me tell you, it's not keto, but it's delish. <laughs> mm. Give y'all a little tour. Oh, they used to have tables up there, but now it's a private room. Beautiful in here, isn't it? Adjust my selfie. Now you notice I got another selfie right there doing my filming. Okay. <laughs> I'm doing a twofer. You doing okay, Mhm. Mm you can see, and they're real nice here. I met Mr. Ciro, and he's real nice. There's a tour of the restaurant. Y'all ever come to Houston, Texas, come on over and eat here. Uh, I'm not getting paid to do this video. I have to pay myself, pay my own way. <laughs> I, I do try new restaurants, but if I don't like it, I don't go back. Like, I probably won't go back to Capitol Grill because unless you have $200 to spend, at the dinner time menu, it ain't worth it. I'm not gonna spend $22 on a small itty bitty hamburger and it was cold. It doesn't meet my standards. <laughs> and um, yeah, so we, Got everything going on. Got my Topo Chico. Last time I was here, I accidentally almost went into the men's bathroom because it doesn't say ombre, it doesn't say womany, and it doesn't say men's. 
says something different. It's a slang Italian, and I didn't know what it was. I was going in the wrong door, and they said, ma'am, you're going in the men's bathroom. And I said, oh, sorry. a little bite of this appetizer because I don't want to, I'm going to take it home. I don't want to waste it. But I wanted y'all to see how delicious it is. And I was also hungry. All I have for breakfast is keto toast. <laughs> it's not a lot. Good, I recommend that you get it. And they have a delicious little bread pellet. And um, oh, hello. This is the menu. Um, so I got the stuffed mushrooms as an appetizer, um, and I'll probably get the, I don't know what I'm going to get, I haven't decided yet. Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. I'm just looking at the menu and I'm trying to define what to get. two different batteries. We start this one. But uh, I hope you're enjoying all of my food reviews and my cooking show. I'm trying to make it interesting for everyone. So I'm thinking about getting the veal scallopini so I've had it before but look at that they've got fried soft shell crab I've gotten the chicken before that's a lot of food and we can zoom in that looks good the, the pollo polo they say polo in Italian. Um, and shrimp zero is, that looks delish too. I think I'm gonna get, I always get the same thing, but that's just cause I, I like, I'm kind of like that. I like to get the same thing. But that doesn't mean that everything on the menu, I've never had anything here that was bad. And I've eaten here a lot. I don't exactly live over here anymore, but. Um, yeah. Mm. And it's 
a beautiful day. Now, I did I could have sat out on the patio, but I don't know. I just didn't want to. <laughs> I just didn't want to. But the, y'all how cool I am <laughs> so welcome to the video <laughs> yeah oh I'm thinking about getting the um the veal scallopini um we like uh, with lemon butter or with my marsala sauce marsala is a wine yeah yeah um I'll have the, I don't know, does it come with a salad too? No, it doesn't. Okay. I'll get it with Marsala, and what kind of side does it come with? The polenta and vegetables. Okay. Can I switch out the vegetables and get fries? French fries? Uh-huh. Parmesan fries? Yeah. Okay, and do you see one the polenta or just fries? Or what's the other side options? Oh, we have the spinach, we have a spaghetti, we have broccoli, grilled vegetables. How about uh, some spaghetti instead of the fries? And, uh, Marinara, like a red sauce. Oh no, like an olive oil, olive oil some, some kind of sauce, but okay. not that yes, one. Yes, I got some you. Kind of, a chai, something that would taste you know. Yes, we will do that, definitely. And um, just a small salad. House. Um, yeah, I'm gonna oh, keep season. the the. Oh, uh, you wanna keep wine. the lunch? Oh, it's here. Oh. Okay, yeah, you have one there too. Oh, okay. What's another wine that says, um, that you have? Uh, how about a, a mom the rosé? The mom rosé? Yeah. Excellent. Thank you. So I want y'all to notice how cool I am. You see behind the scenes, the two batteries. And I am on YouTube Live <laughs> while I'm recording. Now that's pretty cool. Um, and you can do that because it's a recorded video. So um, right now I don't have any viewers. My YouTube channel is new. Please subscribe. Um, right here we got the mushrooms. Now I didn't eat a lot of mushrooms because I want to save space for the... Um, I'm getting the veal scallopini. Okay. You can see how delicious this is. <laughs> you know, I am such a cool person. I mean, seriously. Who else do you know that does a recorded YouTube video while they're on YouTube Live? Because they're both being recorded. I'm just, I'm trying to let people know that, um, Trying to let YouTube know that I'm making high quality videos. And you can see now I'm using um what you call it? Um Streamlabs is a third party app. And I have to do that because uh, I don't have a thousand subscribers yet. Oh thank you. But once I get a thousand I can go live on the YouTube app. So then I probably won't be doing a recorded video while I'm going live. I'll be, at that point, hopefully I'll be getting. Oh, hello, how are you? <laughs> it is delish. And look at how cool that is. I'm recording a YouTube video while I'm on my live. How are you doing today? And look at how beautiful this place is. Isn't that 
<laughs> it is pesto pesto stuffed mushrooms um, and uh, and yes I've got two batteries I've got five cords two batteries two selfie sticks I've got one new selfie stick at home at my mansion for my cooking television program Just starting out on YouTube, they don't give you a lot of, um, they don't, they're probably not going to promote your video that much, but I think once they see that I'm producing high quality videos, then they probably will. Yeah. Yep. I was on, uh, Bigo for... Talking to Queen of Thrones for a while. She's not feeling well today. Um, something, something to do with her stomach. Um, I hope she gets it feeling better. But yeah, you won't believe, Helena, I got a Costco membership. Um, now, I don't know that I'm going to be doing a video on Costco because I don't think they're allowed. I think they're real strict. Um, although, I might be able to do one that's vertical without them noticing. Um, but, you know, it's risky. But I'm going to Costco after here. And it's like 90 degrees already in Houston. You know how that looks. like to record on YouTube. <laughs> oh, look at this. I look like a total idiot. This stuff at the table. <laughs> I mean, you gotta admit, I look like an idiot. I can't say cuss words. YouTube doesn't like it if you say cuss words. You don't get as many free views. But if you go back and you watch my video where it says crispy pancetta, you'll notice that I have a different angle now available for my mansion television program on my cooking show. And it's pretty high up. Um, I bought a $20 selfie stick at Target and the $40 one. But the $40 one don't go high. But I bought a $20 one. What are you up to today? Or as we say here in Texas, what's going on in your neck of the woods? <laughs> I'm glad to see you coming in. Where's Mushy? Do you say Mushy or Mushy? Mushy. No, Mushy. Nice nickname. Now look at this. Look at this. Uh, look at these bottles of wine. They're big. But I think they're just for demonstration. Uh, I don't know why it does that. I can zoom in on this one too. Oops. Look at the mushrooms. How's everything else going along? How's your condo coming along? 
you still there? Type, type Y, if you're still there. Anyway, I got veal piccata. Veal piccata with um, what else? Oh, spaghetti with a secret sauce. And what else? Oh, and Helena, if you're still here, they have amazing desserts. I mean, you would just, your mouth, you would have to end that diet. I started my diet yesterday, but I ended it this morning. <laughs> I'll be back on the diet again later today. After I go to Costco. I'm not looking forward to it, but maybe I should see it as a positive experience. getting more people coming in, you know. I could do Facebook Live, but I don't know. Maybe. I guess I probably could do Facebook Live and YouTube Live at the same time. I used to do that. <laughs> a box for them near mushrooms. Because I know, I, know I, was, I was zooming in, I was watching a couple of my videos on my smart television and the quality that this these iPhones record in. You don't need to spend $2,500 on a, um, what do you call it? A fancy camera. I mean, unless you're doing... Unless you're being, making a movie. You can still make a movie with a regular iPhone. You probably have to edit it. Unless you do movies like I do, which are not edited. I prefer not to edit, although I will admit in the past month and a half since I started my YouTube, I did, I was riding my bike and I was holding my phone and it showed a position I didn't want to show on YouTube and I just and I so I ended the video and I trimmed it but that's all I did. Oh great salad turn it around y'all can see the salad <laughs> that's really hard to do all this filming I'm telling you. I look like a I'm sure I look like an idiot. Oh, this is not clipped in. There we go. Either that or it looks like I'm filming their food. <laughs> I could look at it another way. Um. how it is. <laughs> I 
<laughs> okay, y'all, I dropped it. I'm not sure. Don't worry. Be happy. Enjoy your salad. I wish I could eat out every day. Maybe one day. Gotta make money before I spend it. I love to try different restaurants. I do different things. It's a lot of fun. Do you have, I don't mind paying for it, but do you have something that's dry? I don't, this is too sweet. Dryer? You have a, what kind of champagne do you have this? We have a champagne. How much is that one for the champagne? I think like 15. Okay, mm -hmm. I'll do that instead. Yes. Thank you. I don't like sweet uh, drinks. Okay. That was a little bit. Well, there were two reasons I didn't like it. Number one, it was flat, so it wasn't. They used it yesterday. Well, semi-flat. And number two, it was too sweet. But I think it might have been that it was too flat. Maybe she'll just take it off the bill automatically because I didn't like it at all. I mean, the taste of it. This is the creamy Parmesan dressing. Now, keep in mind if you're going to film yourself eating, chances are you will smash your phone and drop batteries and cords. Um, and again, I'm doing the double. I'm on YouTube live right now on Streamlab. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's much better. Thank you. Now, when I, I think they're closing down the Venetian, and I did record it because. No. For multiple reasons. Anyway, I didn't record, but there was the rest they have in the Venetian. I don't know if it's closed down yet, but anyway, they had this restaurant. And it was, I know, it's way more expensive than here. So, uh, um, manager came over and spoke to me in Italian. My meal probably cost $200. But I had um, appetizer, a primi, a secondi, which is an, a an entree, and then I had a dessert, and I had wine with each course, and then I had a, um, a marone. Um, I think it is an after dinner Italian liquor, liqueur, liqueur, I don't know if it's a liquor, but um, the manager was so nice, and I, and he said, well, do you, would you like something with your, I don't know, what kind of dessert I got, and I said, sure, why don't you pick it and surprise me, and he brought like a little glass, it's like a port, it was so good, I liked it. I didn't like the price of all that, but um, <clears throat> I mean, <clears throat> this place is more, I would say moderately priced. The, pl the place I went to in, at the Venetian in Vegas was more, um, more bougie. But they, that wasn't the only Italian restaurant. They had in that courtyard like seven different ones. Oh, it's so good. Now, and the other reason I didn't film is I didn't have my new iPhone. Now I have it. 
this is my um this one is my terabyte. One terabyte iPhone. I just love it. The life of the YouTuber. See? I mean, literally, it takes me a lot of time to get set up and. Um, but I love it. I've, I've done live video and recorded video for seven years. And I'm glad to find a home on YouTube. Hopefully, YouTube will see the quality of my videos. I'm not going to say cuss words or show anything bad. I mean, once they see that I'm uploading quality videos, then maybe they'll start giving me views. <laughs> now, what I do when I do this, again, this phone is on YouTube Live Streamlabs because I don't have a thousand subscribers. But what I do at home, because I can't read the font on Streamlabs, very hard to read. Uh, what I do is I put my YouTube channel on my smart television and I mute it. Because otherwise it's going to be an echo. It's very annoying. Because there's about a... Uh, with YouTube Live... Sorry. There's about a... Um, I don't know how many second delay. Maybe two or three seconds. Yeah. Two or three seconds. Now you can make it longer. You got your Mac, OBS, and all that. But I chose I chose to teach people how to do a YouTube channel with just iPhones. And, and I chose to keep my... I got a 12 Pro Max, 13 Pro Max. 12 Pro Max is 126 gigs, so it's very limited, but the 13 Pro Max is one terabyte. You can get her done. I had 30 videos on there, and I just deleted them after I upload. And then, um, what else? I'm gonna get the 14 Pro, the Mega, I'm gonna get the new one. And then I'll probably sell my 12. Every time my phone comes out with a new one, I'm going to have higher quality video, better camera. I can't talk about Samsung or whatever, Android or Google and all that because I don't know. I don't like it. iPhone is better. It's safer. That's my opinion. Everyone can have their own opinion. So, I'm going to teach y'all how to do a YouTube channel. If I learn new things, I'll teach y'all about it. But it's going to be on the iPhone because I'm not, not financially available to buy all different phones and compare them. And it's not a sponsored video or whatever. I don't know, some YouTubers I see saying at the beginning of the video, this is not a sponsored video, but then other YouTubers, they don't say nothing, they just do their video. So I don't know. I mean, I, th I clearly think it's something that you learn as you go. Hi. Yes. Enjoy your dinner. And can I get some, some extra sauce for the spaghetti, like different okay. sauce? I don't know, what kind of sauce could you bring me? This is olive oil and garlic, right? Yes, some oh, extra you, that. you want some marinara sauce? Uh, olive oil and garlic, just a little extra. Olive oil and garlic, sure. Thank you. Oh, and uh, Oh, I got a fork. Okay. Great. <laughs> Look at that. I gotta move that out of the way. And 
zoom in on that. <laughs> now I told y'all I like a lot of pepper. <laughs> if I ever start editing a video, then I suppose I could have different camera angles. And then I could switch over to a different angle. But uh, probably better to have a computer for that. I mean, obviously, if you're on YouTube and you want to get monetized, you want to make money. Otherwise, you probably wouldn't be doing it. I don't suppose if you already got a lot of money and you want to be a YouTuber, you, from the get-go, you can hire the best editor. You can hire someone to film you. And then probably you'll be YouTube famous within six months. But I feel like it's kind of, in a way, cheating because, you know, not cheating. But I guess you're just using the money you got to jump through the hoop. Maybe it's better to learn how to dribble the ball before you jump through the hoop. <laughs> then you'll appreciate the money more. <laughs> Next time I go to Vegas, I will film. a lot of money to go to Vegas, even if you don't gamble, you know, because you got your Ubers, all the restaurants, your hotel, you're eating out every meal, you can't cook at any time. You know, if I gotta do 10 videos a day, I'll do it. And it probably won't be 10 food reviews a day. I can't eat that much. But, you know. <laughs> it's so good. Oh, I wish I was thin again. looking at that dessert. They've got the Italian gelato. Excuse me, you know? Yes. Yeah, I'm done with that. Yes? Yeah. Okay. That's not really what I meant, but okay. Well, they better be crunchy as he down low. It's, I swear. In Houston, it is getting hot in here. Where's my sauce? I want more sauce. Oh, yeah. And they're making some more sauce. More sauce for you? Yeah, for the spaghetti. We like some of the That's sure. Sure. And do you have the red pepper that y'all put on the chili? Mm -hmm. I mean, on uh, the pizza. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
man. Thank you so much. Sure. I appreciate Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Yes, ma'am. My pleasure. Thanks so much. This is an example. There we go. I got that sauce. I appreciate it. But they made me some sauce back in the kitchen. See that? Right there. Such a beautiful day here in Houston. Enjoying everything? Yes. Such a wonderful day. Such a beautiful day. Enjoy your food. Enjoy your life. Enjoy everything. The sauce bucket is hot. You see here, I'm trying to get the sauce bucket and I'm good. See, that's all fresh with little spinach and garlic. Look at that. Butter. I'm sure that's low fat. <laughs> Not really, but... I mean, they need to make keto spaghetti. They got keto bread, keto tortillas. <laughs> We've got cassava. Cassava flour. Spaghetti. But, uh, mm. Well, that is really good. And I got him to put some Parmesan cheese on the top. And now put some red spice. You see how delish that looks. Let's taste a little bit of that spaghetti. All right. So, I know they're not going to tell me the recipe for that secret sauce they brought out. Because they've already seen me filming, so I doubt it. Not that I would try to get the recipe, but... It was made with, um, I don't know, uh, maybe basil, spinach, I'm not real sure, sure, but, uh, yeah, restaurants like Olive Garden and stuff like that, I think you can go online and get their recipes, I'm sure. Oh, this is so good. So delish. Put a little more red pepper. I'm just a red pepper alcoholic. You can see that's that either butter, olive oil, draining into my marsala, veal. Mm. Thank y'all for tuning in. My latest food review, and I hope that you guys have a blessed Sunday.